this is it guys this is the end of assassin's creed 2 it's the final episode we're going to see what happens at the end of this game i'm really excited to do another play session of such a wonderful game thank you guys so much for joining me on this ride it has been a great time i'm really nervous to see what happens at the end i hope there's a huge twist that just has me in awe with that being said let's jump into it hit that like button if you haven't already helps me on the youtube algorithm let's jump into it assassin's creed 2. what's going on everyone welcome back to yet another episode of assassin's creed 2. we're getting back into the story bombs were dropped in the last episode let me tell you and here we are continuing on with the main quest oh man i'm gonna miss the side content a lot though i really did enjoy like collecting the, the feathers and the viewpoints and all that fun stuff i think we also have to do some dlc in this episode we're gonna finish the game but i do think i'm gonna be doing dlc and such where am i going here oh right here yeah we have the dlc though somebody was asking me in the last episode they were like oh well I'll watch the dlc when you beat the game but i'm like i think we have it dude definitely gonna be checking it out there we go What the heck? What is he doing? Where are they taking it? Capture the cargo from the ship. Hold on, what's going on here? I gotta tail this guy. Where is he? Right there? Oh shoot, this guy's here. Crap. Shh, be quiet. I'm gonna go ahead and take you out. Just need to watch this guy. Oh, he's running now. What the heck? This guy is booking it. Y'all see this? How fast this guy is. All right, he's coming this way. Oh, no, 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 no. Yeah, get down. There you go. All right, what you doing? You're going that way now. Now he's walking. I don't know why he was running earlier. Now he's chilling. Oh. Is he about to meet somebody here? No. Let's go over here. I feel like he's going to turn left soon. Yeah, there he is. Turn and left. Oh, wait, he's going... No? He just juked me out a little bit there. Oh, he's booking it again. What the heck? It's so random. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I hear you. I hear you. I hear you. Oh, no. We're going to lose him. No, we're good. Bro, leave me alone. Oh, look at this. What the heck? He's hopping across the water. Whoa. This guy really is moving. Oh, wait. Oh, he looked behind him. Good thing I'm not there. All right, I'm going to go up. Impressive move. Thank you. I am pretty impressive. Oh, crap. I thought I could go up there. Come on, come on, come on. There you go. Oh, he went this way. Crap. Parkour is not on my side right now. Go, 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 go. Don't lose him. Don't lose him. Oh, jeez. There he is. Oh, I thought I was going to lose him. Oh my God, shut up. Be quiet. <gasps> ah! <laughs> that's fine, that's fine. 
He didn't see it. We're good, guys. <laughs> I am a menace, I swear. Why are you here? Oh wait, no. Ooh. Dang it, Ezio. Oh. I thought he was gonna turn around there. Ah, these guys. Apparently, I was killing Antonio's men in the last episode, and I didn't even notice it. Hey, don't be on the rooftops like that, then, if you don't want to get killed. I'm so used to killing these guys on the roof. Get down now. Get down now. Yo, this guy is moving okay. I actually feel like a real assassin right now, though. I, I kind of like this mission. Whoa. I'm glad they haven't done too many tailing missions like this, though. Because that would be kind of frustrating. Oh, did I die? No. Oh, wait. The whole city's coming out to play. This guy's doing parkour now. Look at this. What? I think they're Why? Oh my god. These guys are on my back too. I might have to use a smoke bomb here in a second. Maybe not. I think I got away. Oh crap. What are you doing, Ezio? Sometimes I accidentally double tap the jump button. The maestro awaits. Oh, I made it though. You will not suffer mistakes. Package it correctly. Do it now. The Spaniards here? That changes things. If I can infiltrate this group, take the place of the courier, they'll lead me right to the Filio di Putana. Oh, okay. Well, let's do that. Let me get these women here. How can we help? Maybe we can go right in? Go, Ora! Give them something Bobby. to think about. <laughs> yeah! Uh oh. Oh, there's people in here. Do I know you? Nope. You sure don't. Aha! Oh my god. Ezio, that actually looks kind of good on you. Feels weird, though. Seeing him like that. I still have my hidden blades, though. I have to pick up the box. <clears throat> yes, sir. This is a moment of great importance. Stay in formation. Make this right. I got you. Aye, aye, Captain. Assassinate the Spaniard. Don't draw attention to yourself. I'm pretty good at doing that, right, guys? Right? Maybe not. Are people going to attack him? He has a health bar. Oh, they're following us. This man sneezed. Ew, I hope you don't have the plague. I may be expensive, but my goods are worth the extra quattrini. I always thought to myself, like, I wonder how it smelled outside. Like around in these like city areas like this. Probably smelled crazy. <laughs> Deodorant wasn't a thing yet. Probably smelled like an anime convention. Hey, at least we get to like actually see the streets and take it all in, you know? When are we ever on street level? Not very often.
Oh, there he is. The maestro. Am I killing the maestro today? Do you really have it? You were not followed. Absolutely. Everything went perfectly. We have followed your orders exactly as specified. The mission to Cyprus was more difficult. Oh! It's you. It's been some time. Let's go! <laughs> we're here. Rodrigo. So, where is he? <laughs> Who? Your prophet. Doesn't look like anybody showed up, Rodrigo. How many people have died for these? For what's in this box? And look, there's nobody here. <laughs> you claim not to be a believer, and yet here you are. Don't you see him? The prophet is already here. I am the prophet. Now give me the apple. Really? Oh. Take it from me. The apple's in there. Oh, we gotta fight him? Come on, he look weak. I ain't even suited up. Oh, I forgot I got this war hammer. <laughs> I forgot. I I didn't re-equip my sword. Can I uh disarm him? Kinda curious. You know what? Oh, okay, hold on. Oh, I can't counter for Jack right now. I'm sorry, guys. It's been a while. Or maybe I just can't. What? Yeah, I don't think I can. Come on. It won't let me instant kill him. Oh, nice. Come on. Let's go, baby. Let's go, baby. Uh, no, 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 no. I want to pull out my... No, I can't. <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> is this all you have? Where is the rest of your people? What people? You really have no idea, do you? Guards! Huh? What is this? Let's do the short blade. I barely use this thing. Uh, hello? <laughs> I can't be that good. Move. Got that guy. Who's next? Whoa, both of them? Ugh, get out of my way. You know what? I should take that. Oh, no, not you. I want this guy to hit me. Got him. Yeah. I'm about to sweep some people. Ugh. It's a sweep. Woo. Look at my sweep. Uh. Get up. Get up. <laughs> I never countered with this thing. God! Uncle! <laughs> Don't worry, Nepote. You are not alone. Let's go! The cavalry has arrived. Uh, we got a butcher knife! What are you doing here? We could very well ask you the same thing. Uh, what? Oh! Your questions, brother. Don't let Bonta uh, leave that box. Let's go! Everybody's here! Yeah, yeah, yeah! The whole squad! They done pulled up! Move! <laughs> I love this moment! <laughs> this is so freaking cool! Go, Antonio! Uh, sorry, Antonio, my bad! <laughs> Hey, hold on, move! Look, my friend. This is so cool! Oh, sorry. Oh, he sweeped me! I didn't know it was possible! Yeah, okay. What fun! We should do this more often. 
Get up. Let's go. This this spear thing is so good. You will die by my hand, just like your father. Her stop that man. Get him. This war has been going on far longer than either of us have played the war. Let's go. <laughs> this is for my father. Oh. Oh, he would run. Paula. He's gone. Paula. But we have what we came for. No. I need to go after him. Do you? Really now? Right. Or are you here for another reason, my son? Theodora. What? Wait, what, what the are heck? You doing here? Perhaps the same thing you are, Ezio. Hoping to see the prophet appear. I came Who's the here prophet? To the Spaniard. I couldn't care less about your prophet. He never showed up. No. But you did. What? No way! The prophet's arrival was foretold. And unbeknownst <gasps> to us, here you are. Perhaps all along, you were the one we sought. Oh my god! Who are you? Niccolo di Bernardo de Machiavelli. Machiavelli! I am an assassin. Trained in the ancient ways to safeguard mankind's evolution. Just like you, and each one of us here. You are all assassins? What? Paola. Volpe eats truly potent. I mean, that makes sense now that we think about it. For years, teaching you the skills you would need to join our ranks. I think it's time. We have our prize, <gasps> but there is much to be done. What a twist! Come, here at sunset. What a f twist! Yo, this twist is amazing. La shea waka umutlak bel kulun munkin. These are the words spoken by our ancestors that lay at the heart of our creed. What? Where other men blindly follow the truth, remember, nothing is true. Where other men are limited by morality or law, remember, everything is permitted. Is permitted. We oh. work in the dark to serve the light. We are assassins. Nothing, nothing is true. true. Everything, everything is, is permitted. permitted. It is. It is time, it's you. In this modern age, we are not so literal as our ancestors, but our seal is no less permanent. Are you ready to join us? I oh am. my god, I'm about to cry. This only hurts for a while, brother. Like so many things. Benvenuto, Ezio. You are one of us now. Come, we have much to do. This is so beautiful. Look at them, they're all doing the leap of faith. Even Paula. Oh my goodness. Oh, Antonio too. That's crazy. Oh. All along, everyone that we have met were assassins. Everyone that was connected to our father was an assassin. And we have the Apple of Eden, which is crazy. Can you believe that? Wow, mind is blown right now. I'm the prophet. Ezio is the prophet. So that means the thieves guild are all assassins, right? Are you okay? Do you want to stop? No, I need to go back right now. What? Is this where the DLC kicks in? That seemed really abrupt. Uh oh. Oh dear. Sean. What happened? Close. How could I have forgotten? What happened? You want to share with the rest of us? Rodrigo Borgia is elected Pope in 1492. Right. Which means Ezio's greatest enemy is now also the most powerful man in Italy. Exactly. Always wanted to visit the Vatican. Are we going to the Vatican? Well, your luck's in, Desmond. Happy days. Because that's exactly where you're going. What? We're going to the Vatican? Oh my God. This is nuts. Where's Leonardo? Fascinating. Absolutely fascinating. What is it, Leonardo? What does he do? I could no more explain this than explain to you why the earth goes around the sun. 
You mean the sun around the earth. It's fabricated mm. with materials <laughs> that shouldn't exist. And yet, this is clearly a very ancient artifact. The Codex refers to it as a piece of Eden. The Spaniard. He called it the apple. Like Eve's apple, of forbidden knowledge. Are you then suggesting that this thing... Whoa! This must never fall into the wrong hands. It would drive weaker minds insane. No doubt the Spaniard will be relentless in his desire to gain it back. Ezio, you must protect this with all the skills we have taught you. How old is Machiavelli? Take it to Forli. The citadel is walled, protected by cannons, and our ally controls it. Who is this ally? Her name is Katarina Sforza. Ah, uh, don't say. I love her. I think I may enjoy this mission. Me too. Thank you for everything, my oldest friend. Wait, I thought we were going to the Vatican. Itzio tells me you travel off into Milano. I have a grand villa in Toscana. You must come visit me there. Notoriety will not increase in Venice and... Oh, really? I should wear that cape then. You know, the interesting thing about Machiavelli is I don't really know much about him, but I know Tupac studied a lot of Machiavelli. He was like obsessed with Machiavelli when he went to prison. He used markers to identify special memories. Let me go to that then. I know Tupac read that book. Uh, what was it? The Prince and something. Maybe it was just The Prince. I can't remember. It was Ma it was one of Machiavelli's books. And Tupac was a firm believer in doing whatever you had to to make it, basically. And Machiavelli was very similar in that regard. That's why, if you know anything about Tupac, you know Tupac uh, had the nickname Machiavelli. For a while. How do I how do I access this? Do I need to use Eagle Vision? Where is it? Is it up top? It might be. Yeah, it is, because it's uh it's like faded. Oh wait. Yeah, we need to go up. Ooh. But yeah, Machiavelli was a diplomat in Italy. He was definitely against the Pope. Wasn't a big fan of the Pope. It's really interesting that he shows up in this game. I wonder how old he is. He's got to be younger than Ezio, probably. I don't know. He looks older in the game, though. Like his, his character model looks a lot older than Ezio. But he might be older. Oh, wait, what? Am I about to fly again? Whoa. Wait, what? We're doing the flying machine here? For what reason? Why am I flying? Uh, hello. Hey, I, I'm not complaining. I like flying. I think it's fun. Whoa. You know, I think another reason why Tupac was really invested in Machiavelli is they ha they both had similar lives. Because I know there was a point in time where Machiavelli, I think he went to prison for a while and was tortured. I mean, Tupac had the same thing happen to him. Although prison back then, <laughs> what happened to Machiavelli was probably a lot worse than Tupac, but... 
I don't know where I'm going. Can I just... Am I supposed to be killing people or am I supposed to be going to a specific point? I don't really know. Whoa. Oh, is that a guy? Dang. That'd be cool if this was just supposed to be like a fun moment that you could just play whenever you want. It might be that. Ah! <laughs> Oops. Oh, okay. Well, we're done with that. Okay, so I looked it up and apparently that memory of you being able to fly and stuff was added in to help people with an achievement back in the day. So I'm not trying to get achievements, so it doesn't really matter to me. But yeah, I guess the achievement was called Fly Swatter. So if you were trying to get that achievement, then you would have to keep replaying that moment. Because you can't replay missions in this game, so there's only one or two real chances of... I think it's just one, actually. There's only one chance of you being able to fly and get that achievement. So that makes sense. Okay, so I had to go re-equip my Sword of Altair. So I am going to go to the mission now and see what's up. Is that her? Is that the beautiful woman, Katarina? Well, well. Look who it is. Madonna. I thought when we met you were a bit special, but an assassin. Mm. Okay, hold on, girl. Let me accompany you. Walk with me, Taro. You're going to love Forli. The cannons in Architadella alone go back a hundred years. The artifact will be quite safe there. Forgive me, but I've never heard of a woman ruling her own city before. It's very impressive. Well, it was my husband's before, of course. He died. Oh. I'm sorry. Don't be. I had him killed. Oh. oh. <laughs> we discovered Rola okay. Moriario was working for the Templars, making a map of the locations of the remaining Codex pages. I never liked that goddamn son of a bitch anyway. He was a lousy father, boring in bed, and a pain in my ass. Boring in bed? Look! Oh no! What's going on? Look, everyone's running. Look at that big knife she's got. What the heck? Girl. Aspetta. What's happening? They came as soon as you left the city walls, Signora. The city is under attack. What? By who? The Orsi brothers, Signora. Oh, sangue di Giuda. Who are the Orsi? The same canalia I hired to kill my husband. It's the Spaniard, of course. The Orsi have no world view bigger than their purse. But how could he know where we were taking the apple before we even knew? Because they're not here for the apple, Ezio. They're after Riario's map. Basta with your map, Nicolo. My children are inside. Oh, porco demonio. Uh oh. Excuse me. Oh crap, here they are. Machiavelli's about to fight with us! Let's go! I know he fought with us earlier, but... Look at Katarina squaring up! He did. I like when you're in big fights like that and they focus on one person and you're like, all right, you just sneak up behind him and go. <laughs> Bye. They're already inside. Double crossing bastards. Is there another way into this place? Aspetta. Perhaps yes. There's an old tunnel under the western wall from the canal. Bene. I'll be right back. Hey, you. Yeah, I'm talking to you. You spineless dogs. You occupy my city, my home. You think I'm going to stand here and do nothing about it? How about I come up there and rip your ballet off? What kind of Not man the are you? Do 
doing the beating of your masters for loose change. You're not afraid of me. You will be when I come up there and cut your heads off, piece down your necks, and shove your faces up my pika! I'll stick your bali with a fork and roast them over my kitchen fire! How's that sound? You laugh! You wouldn't if I was a man. You think I wouldn't do it just because of this? Let tete! Let me tete! My tits, I'm I dead! I you want to see them, don't you? I mean... You wish you could touch them. You wish you could lick them, don't you? Well, come on down here and give it a try. Like a real man. And I'll kick your balls so hard they fly out your nostrils! <laughs> Lurido branco di cani bastardi. Oh my goodness. Tornatevene a casa se non volete finire impallati. I'm learning every cuss word in Italian. Ah, ma forse è per questo che non vi decidete a uscire. Già, scommetto che lo gradiresce assai un bel palo di quercia. Oh my god, a long oaken pole up your where? Ma dove vi hanno pescato? In un convento di monache? Non ho mai visto in vita mia una cozzaglia di codardi peggio. Where did they find you? In a nunnery? Never in all my days have I laid eyes on such an object. Motley crew of cowards. What a pathetic sight. Even after I've had you castrated, you'll not be less than <laughs> Oh, is that it? Girl, are you done? Everything okay? Okay. I think she said her piece. <laughs> I think she said her piece, guys. Oh my goodness. Oh, oh, oh. Oop. Let me fight them over here. I'm gonna help them out. You know, Katarina probably really was like that, guys. I wouldn't doubt it. It's probably right around this corner. Yeah, there it is. Target located. Okay, we can swim under it. Cool. Open the gates. Things is going down. <laughs> I just want to help my boys out. Actually, I was I was kidding. I don't want to help them out anymore. It's like, look at this guy. He started running. Oh, that's not good. That's fine because you know what? We have smoke bombs. Do we even need him? Oh! I don't think I've seen that animation either. And I've put a lot of hours into this game. That man's ex. <laughs> oh. More guys? Jeez. Hello. Give me that. Oh. Yes! That one never gets old. The little push. All right, we need to go up. This man is still trying to sell. <laughs> A war is going on in the city. He's like, hey, come on over here. My goods are expensive, but they're worth, they're worth the price. Come on over and buy something. Bro, do you not see what's going on in your... In your city? Never met somebody so unaware. Oh, we're about to do a double assassination. I love these. Oh! So cool. All right, I'll come down right now. Get the safety inside the Roca de, Roca de Ravaldino. Get 
Oh. Come on, Katarina. Now you got to put those words to action. Oh, she getting bodied over there. Jeez. I got you. Hey, she's kind of cooking. No, she's not. She's just chilling. Oh, there, there she goes. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Dang, I did all the work there. You saw that? Oh, let's let's learn about Machiavelli real quick. Yeah, he was a politician. Unarmed prophets have always been destroyed, whereas armed prophets have succeeded. These cynical words were written by Niccolo Machiavelli, one of the greatest minds of the Renaissance, considered a pioneer of realist philosophy, which was why Tupac loved him so much. He believed that all men are evil and will act upon their vicious nature. If given the chance, he's not wrong. The third son of a Florentine attorney, Machiavelli was tutored by his father in grammar, rhetoric, and Latin. In 1494, he entered government service as a clerk and an ambassador. Made a member of the Florentine Diplomatic Council. See, I said he was a diplomat. He was sent to the courts of France, Spain, and Rome between 1499 and 1512. From 1503 and 1506, Machiavelli was put in charge of the Florentine militia in the city's defense. He recruited citizens for his militia, preferring men who had a stake in Florence's continued success to dispassionate mercenaries. His strategy seemed to work in 1509, when Florence defeated Pisa. Machiavelli continued to participate in Florentine government after the Medici family was chased out, but when the Medici returned, they arrested and tortured him. Yeah, see? He got tortured. He was accused of conspiring against them. Unable to find any wrongdoing, the Medici exiled Machiavelli. He retired to his estate in Santa Andrea, where he wrote his famous works, The Prince. It is called The Prince. Okay, that's the one that Tupac read, and he loved that book. The Discourses on Livy and the Florentine Histories. Machiavelli died in 1527. His place of burial remains unknown. Oh. They don't even know where this man was buried. Sheesh. So he did get out of prison though, eventually, even though he was tortured. Die. Those guys are gonna fight us, huh? Yep. Of course they were. <laughs> Look at him. Oh, come on. Give me that. Ugh. God, we're so strong. I think somebody in the comments of the last video was telling me how flawed the DLC was. They were saying that the DLC is really um, easy. But yeah, like at, th at this point in the game, it is easy. You know, I mean, you kind of have everything by now. Oh. These fools better not die over here, especially Katarina, because she doesn't have no health right now. Look at her. Go out. For what? What? What's happening here? What's that little sword blade you got? Cook that man. Man, Katarina must be really getting in the action because Machiavelli still has a lot of health. They keep sheathing their swords like in the middle of fight. Now you die. Oh, what are you doing? I was about to counter him. There we go. Bro, chill. Let me work. Oh. Look at her over here. What are you doing? Bro, if you don't move, move. Kill this guy. Dang. Uh-oh. <laughs> Imagine getting tripped up like that. 
Ooh. Hey, this guy's kind of nice. Hold on. He was quick with that little short blade, huh? Ooh. Okay, we're done with him. Sometimes I can't protect them because I'm in the middle of an animation. And if they're aggroing enemies and they're getting attacked and I'm in the middle of an animation, there's nothing I can do. Go. Oh, here we go. All right, I, I'm going to protect Katarina the best I can. She just like runs around though. Move, guys. I'm all over the battlefield right now. Look, I'm dancing. Machiavelli, move. Oh, what the heck? Go, take that guy out. Yes, sir. It's an ambush. Oh, no. You know what? Maybe we could do this. Cooked. <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> oh, that's great. Dead. That was the easy way to do it. I'm gonna go. Bambini! But where are Bianca and Ottaviano? Forgive me, Signora. They were playing outside when the attack began. Uh -oh. I don't know where they are. Reinforcements from the mountains! They are breaching the citadel! Ezio, don't let those bastardi get in here! With me! Holding the fort, we got this. This is DLC. This feels like it could be part of the game. Are we not in the mission? Oh, we are. But what is that over there? What's this? Ammunition refilled. Oh, nice. All right, Katarina's getting cooked. Let's go over there. Nice. We need to go up. Oh my god, girl. Look at her with that big knife. Oh, Machiavelli's up here? How'd you get up here, sir? Oh, look at her. She's chasing that guy over there. <laughs> <laughs> that girl ain't playing. Look at him. Ninja running. Yeah, come over here. You dead. This guy's stupid. What are you doing? Sir. What? Push him. Oh, no. <laughs> what the heck? AI is so messed up right now. Oh, let's go this way. Ouch. Come on. There you go. There you go, Ezio. Oh, Katarina, you were in my way. I was about to almost had this guy. Got him though. We held down the fort. That's for sure. 
Oh, there she is over there. Is everybody good now? Are we saved? Did we save everyone? The city good? Got all that money in the village chest. I don't even need it. Caterina! Caterina Sforza! I know you're in there. I have something you may want back. Are you missing any children? Oh, she's going to be really mad. It's your auditore. What a pleasant surprise. I take it you would be the Orsi brothers. Ludovico and Gecko at your service. Basta! Where are my children? Let them go. Of course, Signora. We'll happily give them back for something of yours. A certain map and a certain apple, brother. See, a certain apple indeed. Or shall I slice your baby's necks ear to ear? Bastardi! You think you can threaten me? I'll give you nothing! You want my children? Take them! I have the instrument to make more! When you change your mind, they'll be in the village outside the city! You have one hour! What the heck? Girl! Katerina, no. I can't ask you to sacrifice your children. Right! Nobody's sacrificing anything. Go get them back for me, Ezio. See, you have my word. Diablo needs to remain in the citadel. Keep this safe. Please. I hope she does that. I don't know if you should just be handing over the apple to anyone, Ezio. I know you trust people, but geez. Let's read about the Orsi brothers. Gecko and Ludovico Orsi. Bored with their leisurely life in the countryside, the Orsi brothers decided to spice things up a little. They started a money lending business that was extremely successful, mostly I because bet. they killed anyone who didn't pay them back. Oh, yeah, sounds about right. Then, Caterina Sforza hired them to murder her Templar husband, Girolamo Riario, which they did in true cavalier fashion. They rode up to his palace, waltzed into the dining room, stabbed him in the chest, Oof. ransacked the estate, and left his naked body in the center of town. According to Abstergo's files, Rodrigo Borgia, after escaping from Venice, offered to pay them for the recapture of the Peace of Eden. And, of course, Caterina's head. It was the Orsi brothers' idea to kidnap her children. Jeez. Ask you, what has this world come to when yeah, the rich I know. go so bad? The rich are terrible. You guys see this? They're disgusting. We've seen so many like doing things behind people's back. Traitorous things. It's gross. That girl said she has the instrument. The in she called her kitty cat an instrument. She said, I got the instrument to make more. What? Come back here. I have never heard that in my life. Get down from Jeez. Get down, Imagine if you were kidnapped and you heard your mom say that. Yeah, go ahead, kill my children. I'll make more. <laughs> There's plenty of baby daddies out there. My goodness. I've never even seen kids in this game. Have we? Other than the baby in the beginning of the game? I haven't seen a kid model like walking around or anything. Will they have kids in the later games? Oh, that is impressive. That's a kid? Which way? But you bubble. Hello. I hope you don't really imagine I'm scared of you. You'd be very mistaken. My mama would never let you hurt me. And if you touch one hair on my little brother's head, she will hunt you down and eat you for breakfast. Capito? Oh my god, she's just as spicy as her mom. Grazie, grazie, Messere. But my brother, they're holding Ottaviano at the lighthouse. 
All right, let's go get him. Let's read about her. I want to see what happened when she got older. Let's see. Uh, database, recent entries. There she is, Bianca. Some people live a dream. Bianca Rivario was not one of those people. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> the way they started that. <laughs> that is the most savage thing ever. What is going on here? In 1484, at the age of six, she witnessed the... <laughs> <laughs> At the age of six, she witnessed the sacking of her family's palazzo in Rome and was carried by her lunatic warrior mother into a siege at the Castel Sant'Angelo. Next, dragged by her family to Forli, far more horrifying delights awaited her. Shortly after Bianca's 10th birthday, her father, Girolamo, was stabbed to death and his naked body thrown into the middle of the town square. That's terrible. Then her family's palazzo was sacked again and she was kidnapped by the Orsi brothers. Bianca escaped the Orsis and returned to her mother. How exactly this escape was accomplished is unknown. Then, when she was 16, while out on a hunting expedition with her mother's new husband, Giacomo Feo, she witnessed his brutal ambush and assassination. Oh my God, girl! In 1500, Bianca's mother was taken prisoner by Cesare Borgia and apparently R-worded by Rodrigo and Cesare. Cesare then killed Bianca's husband, Estor III Manfredi in 1502. She married again, this time to a count. Oh my God. Who died in 1521, at which point she wisely decided to give up on life and went to her grave sometime around 1522. Okay, that's sad. That would be a man. Why they gotta hit me with an entry like that? Oh. Her whole life was traumatic. You guys saw that? I did not like reading that one. That was not fun. She didn't have a stable home to live in. She didn't even have a dad for the most part. Every man in her life pretty much was taken from her. That's terrible. And then her mom had eventually, because her mom got kidnapped. Not good at all. No, I can get him. I want no I want to shoot that guy. Oh, but you can't shoot long range. Somebody told me that in the last episode. Oh, he did. <laughs> Why was he looking down there? You want to see your boy walk again, Katarina? Give us what we want, or I'll throw him off the edge. Mama, help me! I don't want to be here anymore. Ah, probably not. Sit down, Marmocchio. Uh oh. Let's go, Katarina. Hey, Show yourself. Lose him. You have to run the map, or your kids are crippled. Oh wait, no. <laughs> Let's see why. This is a bad time to pee. You the ill peco. I know how he feels though. When you gotta pee, you gotta pee. Aww. Stop acting like a baby. What are your balls? I don't know, but yours is about to be cut off pretty soon. Where are you at? They gonna bully a little kid. That's disgusting. Basta, basta! You're giving me a headache. Yeah, I see you, homie. Your last chance, Katarina. The apple now, or I break the boy's legs. It's like he knows I'm here. Oh, he doesn't. 
We should though. Ah! Katerina was a fool to send you. Or are you the fool? Dying for a handful of change. Was it worth it? More than you know. The maestro gains his price. Because of me. Mori Cortuor Ogolio. Die with your pride for all it's worth. Requiescat in pace. Requiesce. Alright, here we go. Grazie, signore. Yo, what was up with his bangs, though? Otto Viano entered the service of the Florentine Republic as a condottiero when he was 19 at the request of his mother, Caterina Forza, who wanted to submit amiable relations with Florence. He commanded 100 men from Forli, but terminated his contract after only a year because Florence didn't have the money to pay him. Don't, don't blame him on that. Despite accounts which described Otto Viano as obese, brainless, and under his mother's thumb, Pope Alexander VI offered his daughter Lucrezia to Ottaviano. Why? Because Rodrigo decided that those were traits he could tolerate in his son-in-law, as long as that son-in-law was the key to controlling the territories of Forli and Imola. Oh, that's gross. Plus, his praying mantis of a daughter, Lucrezia, rarely stayed married to one man for long because she was crazy. -a. She was. She sounds crazy. Her husbands tended to sign declarations of impotence or just simply disappeared. Ill, wisely, Katerina denied the marriage, enraging the Pope and leading to his son Cesare's assault on Forli. When Katerina was ousted by Cesare and entered her exile in Florence, under her guidance, Ottaviano attempted to convince the new Pope, Julius II, to give him back the lordship of Imola and Forli. But instead, Ottaviano ended up selling the Rirario claim to just Julius for an IOU, no less. Ugh. Well, it sounds like he had a better life than his sister, man. His sister really went through it. I feel horrible for her. I mean, let's be honest, though. The whole family is dysfunctional and kind of disgusting, but... It seems like their, her, their mother... Made them that way, though. Oh, I need to become anonymous. There we go. I know. You told me about the special memories earlier. What are you doing out here? I'm so sorry, Ezio. I'm so sorry. Oh, did they what take happened? it? It was a trick to lower our defenses. As soon as you left, they attacked again. Kedko Orsi, he has the apple. What? No. Where is he? We chased him out here. But the bastards escaped into the mountains. I'm going. Oh, my God. I gave them one job. One job. That's what I'm telling you. Like, Ezio really should just keep it to himself. The apple's good in his hands, not everybody else's. Restricted area. Oh, is that him? No, sir. Ooh. Can I not get him? What the heck? Let me get this guy. You know what? Oh, but if I ride the horse, they're going to kill the horse. Oh, jeez. I should have just ran. Oh, but I can get on that horse. Dang, they give you a lot of horses. Oh, there's so many guys after me, though. I don't know if I'll be able to make it. Oh, yeah, I can. Sweet. Oh, baby, you're dead. Wait a second. What, what's going on? Go, 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 go. Get him, get him, get him. Get him. There it is. <laughs> so, you have your prize again. Was it worth it? So much bloodshed. 
<coughs> a prize of such value. It will not remain yours for long. We shall Ooh, see. we got that blade ready. Che miseria nascono dalla vita. Requiescat in pace. Wait! Ezio, what the heck? You got caught slipping. Oh, <gasps> no! That better not be the maestro. Wait. Don't. Who are you? Stop. Don't open it. Well, what the f What were you thinking, Ezio? What was going through your mind? How my boy get caught slipping like that? Ezio, thank God you're back with us. Are you all right? What happened to you? I, I don't know. Bro, I got cooked. Luck to find you in the hills, next to Keko Orsi's dead body. See, that I remember. Wait, there was a third man. He took the apple. Who? He wore a black robe, like a monk. And I think... <gasps> he had a missing finger. Missing finger. See, si. Katerina, I have to go right away. Of course. What if he's like an ex-assassin? Then you will need this as well. The map Nicolo spoke of. Your husband. Ex-husband, mio caro. He swore he'd uncover the locations of all the Codex pages. You will recover the apple, but you will never find the vault. Without this, you know, there is an abbey in the wetlands near here where uh. I've seen monks wearing black robes. I'd start there. Now go, find us a stramaladetto monk. I think I'm going to miss you, Katarina. Oh, I know you will. Okay, baby girl, what's up with these faces? All right, so we need to leave. Oh, right here. You should not be up here. Leave. Sorry. Merda. Bro, just let me go, dude. Chill. I am glad I'm playing the game like this, though, because I was debating if I should put all of the lore stuff in this episode instead and have a really long final episode, but I was like, nah, let me just knock out all the final missions in one episode. So then like everybody has like a really good episode to watch. Cause I know last episode was really long, especially towards the end. Cause I was reading all of the codexes and then we saw the cutscene with the mother. And then we also did all the glyphs and stuff like that. But I think it was a good idea to do it in that episode. So then we could have like a, a pretty action packed finale. Search the abbey located in the among the wetlands for the black robed monk who stole the apple of Eden. Okay. Uh, so he's out here somewhere. Use the eagle vision. Oop. Guard up top. All right, I'm gonna try to take this guy out. Down or I shoot. Oh, shoot. Cut him off. Oh, oh, there he is. That's him. Blessings Got him. on you, brother. Grazie. I wonder if you can help me. What do you see? A monk in black robes who lacks one of his ten fingers. Well, Brother Guido has only nine toes. You sure it wasn't a toe? Quite sure. 
And then there's Buddha <laughs> Domenico, but it's his entire left arm he's lacking. Again, quite sure there was a finger. Hmm. Now wait a moment. I do recall a black robed monk with nine fingers. Yes, of course. When we had our last San Vincenzo's feast at the Abbey. Yes, I know the place. I'll try there. Grazie. Go in peace, brother. I always do. Brother O'Callaghan? Who is that? Born beyond the pale, outside the area of British control in Ireland, which was considered savage, hence the expression beyond the pale, Darby O'Callaghan spent his teen years hunting and raiding British settlements. In his papers, he describes the time period as a dark point in my life, but to be honest, I had my fun too. When O'Callaghan's Gaelic father married a Catholic, everything changed. He forced me to work the fields. No more raiding, no more girls. It was hell on earth, says one particular entry, dated 1462. To escape his father, O'Callaghan decided to become a monk. I was told by my mother that monks did little work and threw large feasts for the seasonal holidays. He joined the Abilara Monastery in 1462, becoming a Cistercian? Cistercian? Ultimately, however, O'Callaghan found the order to austere, or austere? We worked in the fields from dawn until dusk. Abbot Shaw wouldn't allow us to drink, and worst of all, the only girls were nuns. This was a deeper level of hell than I had ever imagined possible. <laughs> Oh, poor guy. Convincing a small group of his fellow monks to join the Dominicans, Darby left Ireland in 1463 for Italy, where we can hire farmers to work for us in the fields. Then we can give our sermons. We will see the beauty of the Lord in the golden light of Italy and the soulful faces of the farmers' wives. Oh my gosh. Ultimately, O'Callaghan was kicked out of the Dominican order in 1493 due to repeated attempts to convert townspeople while within a drinking house. <laughs> In Darby's own accounts, he claims that he had great success with the conversions, although the men refused to come to church, so I had to return to the alehouse for repeat visits to preach the word of the Lord to the receptive ears. <laughs> he could only talk to them while they were drunk. Callahan moved to the Ramona countryside in 1494, starting a monastery dedicated to the Order of St. Patrick in an abandoned church, but he didn't have much success in securing converts. Yeah, because it wasn't a, a bar or something in 1500. He died of what had been described as bad blood, but was most likely syphilis. His body was buried in the small cemetery uh, uh, beside the church. Oh my goodness. This man got syphilis and died. That's horrible. What a way to go out. I wonder if he ever got those farmer's wives. He probably did. It's probably how he got the syphilis. Um, should we go this way? Let me kill it. Oh, no, I don't need to. My, notori my notoriety is not that high. I was going to kill one of the witnesses, but never mind. Is he in here? Yeah, he's right there. Apparently. Do I need to kill him? Excuse me, brother. I wonder if you can... Uh, uh, unholy demon! Get away! What's wrong? You're the one who killed Brother Stefano! Brothers, the killer of monks has returned! Uh-oh. I don't remember doing that. He didn't get very far. <laughs> Please, no, I don't want to die. I only kill those who kill others. And your brother Stefano was a killer. I'm sure you are no such thing. Now, uh, listen to me. Sure. I'm looking for a black robed monk who's missing a finger. Missing a finger, you say? Do you mean like Fra Savonarola? Savonarola? Who is this? You know him? I did. He was one of us for a time. And then? We suggested he retire to a hermitage for a good long time. I'm afraid to say his retreat has come to an end. Where would he have gone? Oh dear. Santo Spirito in Firenze? It's where he studied. Perhaps it's where he would return. I thank you. Go with God, brother. What's 
Let's see what this guy is all about. Girolamo Savonarola, a Dominican friar from Ferrera, this man took his job seriously. He saw the excesses of his age, the rich stomping the poor into the dirt, the priests selling indulgences to the populace, and he went insane. Calling himself an instrument of God, Savonarola descended on Frenze. His sermons sent people into frenzies. He demanded an end to all personal property, to all progress, a return to Eden. Knowledge became the enemy. And he could erase it all with the piece of Eden at his command. Whoa. Books, paintings, musical instruments, he burned everything in the bonfire of the vanities. Really? History unraveled as his legions took control, and Firenze descended into darkness. God. So he was Dominican? Are we done with that area hey, now? Desmond, I think I repaired that busted memory. Why don't you try opening it? What busted memory? What you talking about? Oh, okay. Here we are. So it was like an intermission. That song hit every time. In Florence, we're going to meet up with Machiavelli. All right, guys, I had to go get some water. Ironically enough, some Pellegrino. It's funny because this uh, this company is actually based in Milan. Um, I think it was founded in Bergamo, Italy, which is like a hour outside of Milan, I do believe. If anybody from Italy can correct me, you can correct me. But uh, I love this water. I usually drink Topo Chico, but I'm drinking Pellegrino today because this is all they had at Costco. <laughs> I love sparkling water, though, because I am an avid Coke drinker. I love Coke. And I need to drink more water. And the only way for me to drink water is if it's kind of like soda. I just love the carbonation of soda. So water gives me the best of both worlds. You know, I get the I get the health benefits plus my carbonation like it's soda. Right. So, hey, I can't complain. <laughs> I love it. All right. We're ready to go. Let's start this mission. If Piero had only a tenth of his father's talent, hey, yo, what's going on? Some place to call home. I gotta tell them. Become anonymous. Okay, I gotta. My bad. Never should have welcomed that mad monk into the city. Look at all the misery he's wrought. Oh, everybody's following me. This isn't good. My notoriety is like super high here. Ah, oh, they're going to chase me all throughout, aren't they? Oh, maybe I just got to fight these guys. I'm just going to fight them. Screw it. Oh, dear. There's a lot going on here. Okay, let's go. Oh, we're not taking anyone from behind. Get away from me. That sounded wrong. There we go. Now I'm anonymous, I guess. Okay, we got to go this way. Move. Move. Excuse me, people. Excuse me. Yeah, we'll go up this. Hit those rooftops. Since we're so notorious in this city, we'll be able to jump this way. Look how gray it is here. I don't think I ever remember it looking gray like this. I don't understand why they'd be so willing to accept his oppression. What are they talking about? 
There's a lot of noise going on on the streets, huh? Sometimes I wish the assassino would return to Firenze. That we might be free of his tyranny. It's just a myth. A story parents tell their children. The assassin? Me? Salve, Ezio. You picked a fine time for a homecoming. Then it's true. Savonarola has taken control of Firenze. Yes. No doubt aided by that treacherous artifact. We should get to work on retrieving it. That may be more complicated than you think. <laughs> when isn't it? Why don't you fill me in on things? Walk with me. It all started a few weeks ago. The man everyone once reviled was suddenly the one they worshipped. Ah, the apple. Only in part. It's not the city he's enthroned, but its leaders. Men possessed of influence and power. They, in turn, oppress the citizens and ensure his will is done. The people act as if they have no say in the matter. Rare is the man willing to oppose the status quo. And so it falls to us to help them see the truth. Hmm. Those bodies bear the emblem of the Borgia. Yes. The Spaniard keeps sending his soldiers into Firenze. And Firenze keeps sending them back. Usually in pieces. Then he knows the apple is here as well. An unfortunate complication. Stay close. Alright, well, let's go in. This man has taken over. No wonder why people are saying all these things about me. Ah, oh, crap. Yeah, this isn't looking too good. Did you die? Oh, man, we're getting cooked. Oh, God. Dude, these guys are actually kind of strong. You guys see this? Maybe they did up the difficulty like a little bit. All right, let's get this guy. All right, y'all ready? took that I was trying to counter him though follow my lead the assault will be dangerous true but what other option is there aside from the city leaders the people's minds are their own correct see si. and they follow Savonarola not by choice but force and fear see si. then I propose we use these to our advantage we can silence his lieutenants and stir up discontent. He will be distracted, and I will have a chance to strike. Clever. I'll speak with La Volpe and Paola. They can help to organize the uprising as you free the districts. Hey! Then it's settled. I'll take care of his abettors. La Volpe. We haven't seen him in a while. Whoa! How many? How many lieutenants has this guy got? Whoa, look at this. We got three right here. Four, five, six, seven, nine. Sheesh. I got to go kill nine people. But well, one of them's in here somewhere. Or he's up. Yeah, I've heard it before. Reject the base and material. Seek salvation in the flames. All 
All right, let's assassinate him. Oh my God. And each one of them is like its own mission too. That's a lot. Uh-oh. Where is this guy at? Oh, there he is. Nobody saw me do that. Here there was an opportunity to grow closer to him. Or if divinity was perfection, then surely capturing him would be divine. It seemed a righteous one. A form of prayer, of worship. And if others might gaze upon my creations and see something of the Lord within, well, would they not be also brought closer to him? And so I thought myself an altruist, a speaker, a preacher. I wonder if he's going to come back around Because if he comes back around I can just walk up And then get out You know Simple Easy Clean Yeah it seems like he's coming back around That's exactly what I'm going to do I'm going to stab him up Right in that gut Hit a smoke bomb Bust up out of there Simple Yeah, here he comes. I pray that you will join me. Free yourselves of deception and corruption. Give up your blasphemous works. In True. Canvas, evoke this. <laughs> Got him. What have I done? What have I done? Your actions were not your own. Oh, nope. they were. My own self-doubt let him hold me as he did. I am sorry. Aww. As am I. I feel bad for him. Shelter, compio, a cuor leggero, so does Ezio. Requiescat in pace. That's no good. I'm out. Oh, it did everything for me. Here they are. Oh. Maybe that didn't work as well as I wanted it to with the smoke bomb, but we did good. All right, the other one's over here. Stop. Whoa. Ah. I don't like how it takes it off the map. Wait, aren't these my people? Bro, leave me alone. Oh, wait, but it says I could go here. There's another viewpoint? Oh. Well, it's fine. Non si passa. Do you hear me? Until you've all submitted and given yourself over to the prophet, Savonarola, this bridge will remain closed to you. I hear you moaning and complaining. You say you have things to do, places to go, obligations to fulfill. Ha! You have but one obligation to submit now. Hey. Why, Why raise this? There he is. He's he loose. He's ours. Get him. Your precious Medici have abandoned you, fled into the wastes to wallow in self pity. Savonarola Ooh. wants only the best for you. A city free of vice and temptation. A people united by faith. All men nice. are equal in the eyes of the Lord. Wait, he stopped talking. Why? Oh. 
Oh, he dead. Nice. You wear a noble's clothes. How is it Savonarola charmed you? Wealth and power do not ensure contentment. I wanted even more. And now instead, you have nothing. Axe. Questo non è che un atto dovuto. Requiescat in pace. Ooh. Uh oh, everybody's gonna come after me now. Yep. That was kind of cool. Like, I felt like a legit assassin right there. Throwing that smoke bomb down and just like hopping away like that. Like, so gracefully. I want to do that again. I really need to get that viewpoint. There's another one right next to me, though, so I'm going to do this one. People of Firenze, come gather round. Listen well to what I say. The end approaches. Now is the time to repent. The end to of the game. God's forgiveness. Doomsday. He's out here preaching that doomsday. Are all around us. Unrest, famine, disease, corruption. These are the harbingers of darkness. We must stand firm in our devotion, lest they consume mm. us. All. Oh, I see you doubt that you think me mad. Did the Romans not say the same of Jesu? Know that I too once shared your uncertainty, your fear. But that was before Savonarola came to me. He showed me the truth. At last, my eye. And so I stand before you to get him dead. Oh, shoot. Everybody knows I'm here. That guy dip. What the heck? Why is he running like this? This guy's stupid. <laughs> your mind, since it is your own. <laughs> Not all of us require deception to be convinced. I already believed. All I said is true. Okay, that's how you feel. Nothing is true. Non è un compito facile il mio. It's not an easy thing to do. Requiescat in pace. It's not an easy thing at all, Ezio. I'm glad I'm not in your spot. Whoa! Get out of there. You guys, imagine being a voice actor in Assassin's Creed. That would be nuts. That'd be so cool. I'd love to, like, play, like, a small part, like... Like a NPC or something like that. That'd be fun. I know Co Carnage, who's a pretty popular streamer on Twitch. I think he's in uh, Cyberpunk as an NPC. I remember seeing that somewhere. Secure those crates. We can ill afford to let their contents fall into the wrong hands. Board the ship without being seen and put an end to the merchant's trading days. Your trading days are over with. We'll see just how tough the holdouts are. Wait until we get to Assassin's Creed 4. And we're really able to use the boats. What? Was I not supposed to do that? Was I supposed to just remain unseen? This one is so hard, guys. I don't know what to do. The guy is like on a particular part of the ship and you can't be seen by anyone. If you're seen by anyone, you, it's an instant fail. It's kind of goofy. I'm going to try to do it now. Okay, let's see if we can. Can I get him? Oh, I did it. Oh, dude, that one was so hard to do. 
What? What have I done? You tried to force devotion. Sometimes the people must be told what to think. No good has ever come of that. Benché il mio cuore sia turbato, la mia mente è lucida. Requiescat in pace. That man said his head is clear. <laughs> what? Come back here. This man Ezio is cold. Your orders are simple. Keep watch over these fields and ensure no harm comes to the bundles of fiendo. It may seem a mundane task, but it is critical nonetheless. <laughs> Uh, this most basic resource. They lose the means to resist. They will be forced to stand down. Already, many have fallen into line. They require clothing, food, shelter, water, and all of these things are born of here. Come here. I hear you grumbling. You think this post a waste of time? But you must understand. Oh, he's over there. Our very existence depends upon keeping all of this things. Oh, what the heck? Is he coming my way? <laughs> he came my way. You would have let your own people starve. And for what? Too long I suffered their insults. They called me simple and low class. I wanted their respect. I'm afraid you do not have mine. Per quanto sia venoso e trapasso. Though the past may be painful, it will be a gentle sleep. Oh, isn't that sweet? That's another one down. Come, my peeps. Bring in the people. All right, we got a couple more here. Um, in the comment section in the last video, some of you guys were saying that I was going to like Unity. Somebody said I was going to like Unity, Origins, and 3. I think I can agree with that from what I've seen of each of those games. I hope Origin allows me to like, I don't know. Cause I know the RPG games have like really crowded UI and I don't really like that. It breaks my immersion. I hope I can turn that off. Something is wrong here. Oh, Where is everyone? I'm not a challenger. What? Excellent. Am I gonna have to fight? Savannah Roller warned me that some would oppose our rule. And so I devised this little trap to ferret out those foolish enough to play at hero. It's proven to be both entertaining and effective. Sure. Incoming Chamo. Incoming Chamo. Oh, you're about to get assassinated, big boy. Just how long you survive. Yeah, I wonder. Another a few days back, they did over three dozen. Three dozen? That's pretty good. Every day without fear. Another of you are a revolutionaries. I've seen heard what? You need your capo's permission? Liberty. <laughs> These guys are fast, man. These are lies. No matter what you are for the same reason. Cooked. This guy won't shut up. Spiritual. So He's just spewing nonsense. Did your father abuse you? Did other children tease you? Did a lover spurn you? What? I would suspect a form of insecurity. Why else do you wear the hood? A form of insecurity? 
saddle. I see these words are a waste. <laughs> Serving only to send you further. I power. Am I friend? Am I in a frenzy or am I just annoyed, bro? Like, what do you mean? I don't know. I'm coming up there. This is ridiculous. I'm not fighting any more of your men. I'm fighting you now. Oh my god, there's so many. Come on, homie. You know what? Don't you want to play like this? Okay, stop. Stop. Oh my god, I'm still getting hit by the archers. There it is. <laughs> that looks funny. Is this truly who I was? So proud and cruel. No. Savonarola bewitched you. Did he? Or was it that I tasted the power and found myself intoxicated? I wish I had been stronger. As do I. Mirin Cresce. Why does it take them dying like to realize that what they were doing was stupid? Oh. I guess for some people it takes that. I just find it kind of silly. You had all this time to learn. Oh crap. No, you haven't seen me before. Okay, so we still have this one and so we have three more. Okay, here I am. You must not disrupt our work. Firenze is sick. It's our duty to cure her. How? By forcing our people to follow a madman? It is unwise for you to challenge those in power. Yes. Well, that is about to change. No! You won't take me! Savonarola will know of your treachery! Guards! Guards! Yeah, you can scream that all you want. But I'm gonna get you. Oh, you're cooked, bro. You should not have come in near... Yep, you should not have come near me like that. You're cooked. You should have jumped on the other roof. Things are better under him. Under Dang. Us. It's gonna suck to be you, buddy. What the? I tapped X and everything. No. Oh, come on, Ezio. I'm about to lose this guy. Or maybe not. I should have had him way back there. You guys saw that. What? Okay. I was a victim. It's not my fault. No, you made the choice. He charmed me with that thing. Only because you allowed it. Lo faccio per il popolo. Reguiesca. For the people! People. Oh, I get out of here for the freaking people. We should be good now. I've escaped. All right, the next one isn't that far away. Upward mobility. Yeah, I feel like a lot of these, like pretty much each and every one of these are testing all of your different skills. Like one would be stealth. The other one is parkour. It's kind of fun to see that. They're not all like super linear. Go this way. Um. 
Oh, I'm, I'm going past it. I'm stupid. I got confused. I was going to the other one that was flashing. Is that a prayer? About the stealth again, but this time we're climbing. Another cell saw. What's he? Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Uh oh. Okay, we made it. Oh, there's two guys up here. Oh, I hear him now. Oh, crap. The guy over there. Oh, there's a guy over there, too. Can't go up here. I can't jump up and grab that, can I? Oh, wait, no. Actually, no, that was good. Is that Latin? Uh -oh. I don't think he sees me though. That's a good sign. Got him. Yes. All right, we should be able to get this guy now. Shut up. <laughs> I got the power. I thought he preached the word of God. I fear his sermon is a lie. I led my flock astray. It's just I wanted so badly to believe. Yeah, we all do. Right. Metro computer. L'opera di mio padre. Oh, there you go, Ezio. I will see my father's work completed. Axe. <gasps> oh. 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 My life flashed before my eyes right there, guys. Oh, my goodness. Can we slowly just descend? Yes. Perfect. My freaking life flashed before my eyes. Okay, leave me alone. Ooh, stabbed him in that area? That did not look fun. Yes, sir. Just drop down on someone. Is this a doctor? It's quite simple, Amici. No. If you desire care, you'll submit yourselves fully to our new ruler. Or maybe it is. Yeah, it is. Support the Medici, who, as you know, have long since fled Firenze, or accept Savonarola. Why fight it? Why refuse? He is a good man, strong of character and more. Got him! Aha! You have spilled the blood of a healer. Get, out, get that out of no. here. I have spilled the blood of a tyrant. Yeah, exactly. To command such power over the body between this world and the next, it seems I grew intoxicated. 
And now you grow still. La tua morte non sarà inutile. Your death will serve a purpose. Pace. Sure will. All right. Bye. Those things are perfect for escaping, huh? There they are. I've got my people here. All his lieutenants are gone. We're completely done with them. Is it time to go take him out now? Dang, that's far. Well, I'll be back then. All right, we're here. Let's go. Move out the way. You've done well, Etsy. What happens now? Watch. Silence! I demand silence! Are the people gonna kill him? Why are you here? Why do you disturb me? You should be cleansing your home! Cleansing yourself! There are bonfires to feed, prayers to be said, penance to be done! You will do as I command! You will submit! Oh. You uh. will Let's go! It can't be far. Somebody's gonna pick it up, huh? What's that guy doing? Oh, it's him. Get him, get him, get him. Go, 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 go. Get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. Where's the music? Oh, crap. Merda, merda. Ah, I'm so quick. I'm so freaking quick with it. I'm so freaking quick with it. I got the apple. I got the apple. That man did not get far at all. Wasn't even a... Wasn't even a chase. That was a speed run strat. <laughs> Power to the people for real. That was a quick mission. Dang. Okay. I got the apple back. Wonder if we're going to use it to beat Rodrigo. Here we go. God bears witness to the sacrilege that you would handle this prophet this way. Blasphemers, heretics, you will burn for this. Do you oh. see? You will burn. There's only one person burning today, sir. Listen to him pray. Oh, that's so cute. No one deserves to die in such pain. Oh, wait, what? Let him die, Ezio. What are you about to do? Ooh! It's you. I knew this day would come. Please, show mercy. Dear Lord, Ezio. I have. That was mercy, bro. He took you out. Ora, che sia il tuo Dio a giudicarti. Requiescat in pace. He said, judged by your God. He said, not mine. Your God, bro. stand now and watched my loved ones die betrayed by those I had called friends vengeance clouded my mind it would have consumed me were it not for the wisdom of a few strangers Aww. who taught me to look past my instincts they never preached answers but guided me to learn from myself Aww. We don't need anyone to tell us what to do. No. Not Savonarola. Not the Merici. We are free to follow our own path. 
There are those who will take that freedom from us. Too many of you gladly give it. But it is our ability to choose whatever you think is true that makes us human. There is no book or teacher to give you the answers, to show you the path. Choose your own way. Do not follow me or anyone else. Yes! What a speech, man. But I will say, um, some people choose different ways to learn, though. Some people like to follow people. You know what I mean? That's how they learn. Well, I'm at the villa now, and I might as well go collect my money. Wait, are we going to put the... Oh! We're going to put it on this little pedestal or this mantle over here, huh? The Eden? The piece of Eden? Yes, we are. <gasps> yeah, they're all here. We are. We are. Oh, this is so cool. Ezio. It is time, uncle. Let us finish what you and my father started all those years ago. Indeed. Perhaps now we can finally make sense of this prophecy and put a stop to whatever it is the Spaniard is plotting. We should start by locating the vault. The codex pages will lead us to it. Let's take a look. Okay, we gotta decipher the codex pages. I've already done that though. Is it already completed? Yeah, I think it is. What do you want me to interact with? Oh, is this all messed up again? No, it's not. What do you want me to do? Oh, so you're forced to get all of those. You have to do the codex pages. That's completely part of the game. It's part of the main story. It's not extra. It, it is a map of the entire world, but there are lands shown here that do not exist. Apparently they do exist. I imagine they've yet to be discovered or rediscovered. How is this possible? Perhaps the vault will hold the answer. Do you see where it is then? No, it can't be the vault. It looks like the vault is in Roma. Oh, it's in Roma. Spaniard. This is why he became Pope. Now I understand. It's not the vault alone he's gained access to, but the staff as well. What staff? The Codex always spoke of two keys. Two pieces of Eden needed to open the vault. Right. One is the apple. And the other is the staff. The paper staff is the second piece of Eden. For years, no. Decades we've sought these answers. And now, at last, we have them. But so too could the Spaniard. And if he does, if he finds a way into the vault, its contents will make the apple seem a trifling thing. I must go to Roma and find the vault. What are the rest of you? We'll do what we do best. Cause some trouble in the city, giving you the freedom to conduct your search. Just let me know when you are ready, Nipote. I am ready. I am definitely ready. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I'm ready to Roma go. Beckons, Ezio. Let me know when you are ready to depart. It's time to go to Rome. Yes. Let's go. We're going to find this Pope. We're going to put him in a grave. We aren't playing around. Look at this, Roma, fourteen Infiltrate the Sistine Chapel and assassinate Rodrigo. It's time, boys and girls. 
Let's do this. This is what we've been trying to get to all this time. Actually, no. Let's go up here and let's do this. Yep. Gotta go right around here. Oh, look at that. Little final little parkour puzzle before we uh, finish the game. Where does uh, Brotherhood take place, though? Bye. Oh, what the heck? Did you guys see that? Oh, geez. See the blood just shoot up out of, into the sky like that? What the heck? Oh, I thought I would get both of them. Come on. Perfect. That's beautiful. Pull the lever, crunk. All right, we're going this way. <laughs> he looked right at me. He let me do that. Ooh. I messed that up. Come now, you bored. You gotta love it. Oh, what is this guy doing now? You are a clown. I love this song. There's a lot of guys up here. Oops. All right, we got to fight him. All right, let's pull the sword out. Go to town. Oh my God, what the heck? You know what? I kind of want that pole that that guy has. Let me get that. Thank you, sir. There you go. Ooh. Ooh. Oh my God. Ezio, chill. God. Assassino! Assassino! Oh, horsey! Ooh! Let's go! Okay, my bad, guys. I had to go do something real quick. Let's continue. All right, can I jump that? Oh, Whoa! Oh god! Go go go! Oh, you stupid! Ah! <laughs> oh my goodness! I couldn't make it. I'm out. Where do I gotta go? Up there? Oh, they're definitely going to hit me down. Yeah. All right, I got to fight these guys. Thank you, sir. Oof. I know that hurt. Oh, what the heck? Here we go. Oh, you saw that sweep. I know you saw that sweep. Did you see the form? All of Ouch. Ouch. Oh, it's time to box, sir. Nice. 
This music is hitting though. Mm. Okay. Slow it down. Slow it down. Is there a hay to jump in? Yeah. Woo! Bum, 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 Okay, there it is. There it is. There it is. Keep going. Ah, pick him up. Ooh. Ezio. Why are you like this? Guess I can go up here. There he is. Ah, nice try. Okay. Ouch. Ouch. Come on, hit me again. Oh, okay. Ooh. No. What? Dude, the music makes this moment so awesome. <laughs> guitar part right there that's hot Ooh, right in front of your face hi we work together move oh jesus wait don't let that guy attack this is the most op weapon in the game Look at this. <laughs> when all else fails, sweep. Sweep for your life. Just like that. Look how deadly the sweep is. Yes, sir. Well, I'm nice with it. I'm nice with it. With a lever. There it is. Remain undetected. Uh oh. From who? Oh, like those guards up there? Sorry, sir. Simple. Got him. Another cell. God damn. Out of here. Why me? Always in the wrong place at the wrong time. Please. Just leave me alone. Got him. Oh, that was nice. You can't say that wasn't nice. That was nice. Oh my God. Listen to the music here. I know I keep saying that, but it's always good. There's the Latin again. Visibilium omnium et invisibilium. Et in unum dominum Jesum Christum, filium de inugenitum. Whoa. 
Deum verum de Deo vero. Geritum non factum consubstantiarem patri, per quem omnia facta sunt. Qui propter nos homines et prayer? propter nostram salutem descendit de celi. And Latin? Et incarnatus est de Spiritus Sancto ex Maria. Ah, shut up! <laughs> this is the moment I've been waiting for. I thought, I thought I was beyond this, but I'm not. I've waited too long, lost too much. Requiescat in pace, you bastard. I don't think so. Wait, what? Whoa! How did he not die? This guy invincible? I guess Ezio never stabbed him. He was about to. How is it to resist? I see. Kind of you to bring me the apple. Now give it here. Why a farty for today? My boy. Oh, is the fighter. Just like your father. Well, rejoice, my child. For you will see him again soon. You will give it to me. As you wish. <gasps> Whoa! I'm using it! I'm using it! Whoa! Just like I'm Mo Moalam. Fascinating. An impressive power, this. But if you think it's going to save you, you have another thing coming. Yo. Imagine. Look how many Ezio's there are. I can't take it from him. He's got to fight. Yes, sir. I'll cut you down, assassin. Look at it. The copies of me, they're not doing anything, man. Come on. Work a little bit. How long do you think you can keep this up? I don't know. As long as I need to, I guess. Okay. A clever trick, but useless. Yeah, but what about this? Oh, I can't do it. He won't let me shoot him. <laughs> I want to shoot him so bad. What if I did this? Cut him up. What the heck? <laughs> what the heck was that? <laughs> I guess that didn't really do much damage to him. <laughs> What in the world? Where's like the final battle music or something? Right to fear me. Why is this music so like anticlimactic? Like. Am I being spoiled? But useless. Okay, we're about to kill him pretty soon. I can't believe I'm this man can actually battle against an assassin. Screw this guy, man. I don't even need you these copies. Right fear me. Oh, we're so close to killing him. You cannot stop me. Oh, jeez. There it is. Finally. No, you will not take this from me. It's finished, Rodrigo. Lay down your arms, and I will make sure the end comes swiftly. Really, Ezio? And would you give up so easily were it the other way around? What? Whoa. Why don't we find out? He's invisible now. Use the apple. Oh no, he didn't. At last. 
Oh, now he's got both. That's not good. This man's gonna have like Super Saiyan God abilities. To deal with you. Wait a second. But I'm the prophet, though. Get up, Ezio. Okay, let's uh, use this. All right, we just need to press these buttons. There it is. Whoa, what the heck? This looks futuristic as hell as heck. Look at this. What is this place? Right. That's a good question, sir. Open, damn you. Open! Is this the vault? It's over, Rodrigo. No more tricks. No more ancient artifacts. No more weapons. Oh, he's getting rid of all Let his weapons. See what you are made of. Even the blades? All right, then. If that's how you want to play it. But he's still what glowing. What do you want with the vault, Rodrigo? Don't you know what lies within? Or do you mean to tell me? The great and powerful assassins didn't figure it out. Figure what out? God. It's God that dwells within. What? You expect me to believe that God lives beneath the Vaticano? A more logical location than a kingdom in a cloud, don't you think? Surrounded by singing angels and cherubim makes for a lovely image. But the truth is far more interesting. What? Let's say I was to believe you. What do you think you'll do when you open that door? I don't care. It's not approval I'm after. God might Just be a girl. Power. You never know. And you think you'll give it up? Whatever lies beyond that wall won't be able to resist the staff and apple. They were made for felling gods. God is meant to be all-knowing. All-powerful. You think a couple of ancient relics can harm him? Right. You know that sounds nothing, stupid. Boy. You take your image of the creators from an ancient book. A book, mind you, written by men. Written by men, right. Yeah. You are the Pope. And yet you dismiss the central text of your faith? <laughs> are you so naive? I became Pope because it gave me access. It gave me power. Do you think I believe a single goddamn word of that ridiculous book? It's all lies and superstition, just like every other religious. Oh my God! Over the past ten thousand years. He's not wrong. But hey, hold on. Come on. I needed to hear. I needed to hear that dialogue before I whooped his butt. That was kind of juicy. Yup. He's cooked. He's cooked. Dang. It's over. You can't. You can't. It's my destiny. Mine. I am the prophet. You never were. Get it over That is with, true. Then. No. Killing you won't bring my family back. I'm done. Yes! He realized. He realized. Oh my god. Dude, I was hoping this would happen. I was hoping he'd realize getting revenge isn't going to bring his family back. There's no point. Ezio, you're amazing. You really are the prophet.
Okay, you're chilling here, buddy. I wonder what's gonna end up happening to him. Hold on, let me use the uh, eagle vision. Okay, there's nothing to see here. I was just wondering. Oh, look at this. This looks so cool, though. Is this the stuff that Subject 16 was writing? No, not really, huh? But it does look cool. Greetings, Prophet. It is good you have come. Let us see it. To give thanks. God is a woman. Okay. We must speak. Who are you? Many names. When I died, it was Minerva. Before that, Minerva. the goddess of Minerva. wisdom? And on and on. The others, too. Juno. Juno? Who was before called Uni. Jupiter, who was before called Tinia. Juno's the god of love and marriage, and Jupiter is the god of the sky? These are all Roman deities. Oh my god! No, not gods. We simply came before. Even when we walked the world, your kind struggled to understand our existence. We were more advanced in time. Your minds were not yet ready. Still not. Maybe never. No matter. You may not comprehend us. Why is she looking at me? But you will comprehend our warning. You must. None of what you are saying makes sense. But why are you looking at me? Words are not meant for you. What do you mean by that? What are you talking about? There is no one else here. Oh! <laughs> Enough. I do not wish to speak with you. Is she talking you. about Desmond? You. You are the prophet. You've played your part. You anchor him, but please be silent that we may commune. Listen. I'm listening. I'm listening. Bro, she's the when goddess of wisdom. Flesh and our home still whole. Your kind betrayed us. We who made you. We who gave you life. We were strong, but you were many. And both of us craved war. So busy were we with earthly concerns, we failed to notice the heavens. And by the time we did, the world burned until oh. naught remained but ash. It should have ended then and there. But we built you in our own image. We built you to survive. And so we did. Few were our numbers. Your kind and mine. It took sacrifice, strength, compassion. But we rebuilt. And as life returned to the world, we endeavored to ensure this tragedy would not be repeated. Is that but where Adam and Eve come? We are dying, and time will work against us. Truth turned into myth and legend. What we built, misunderstood. Let my words preserve the message and make a record of our loss. But let my words also bring hope. You must find the other temples, built by those who knew to turn away from war. They worked to protect us, to save us from the fire. Right. If you can find them, if their work can be saved, so too might this world. Be quick, for time grows short. And guard against the cross, for there are many who will stand in your way. It is done. The message is delivered. We are gone now from this world. All of us. We can do no more. The rest is up to you, Desmond. What? Who <laughs> is Desmond? I don't understand. Please, wait. I have so many questions. What the heck? What the actual f Yo, that's crazy! That's a crazy twist. What the fuck? <laughs> Dude, 
I am you right now, Desmond. Dude, that is freaking nuts. What the f What the f What the f Bro. That ending was absolutely insane. Oh my god. It, I know it doesn't just end like that. We didn't even get to wrap up what happened to Desmond. If, if it doesn't wrap up what happened to Desmond, that's crazy because like we barely played as him like that entire game and they gave us There's so many wait. Until I get... Need all of my equipment ready to go. I'm talking. Desmond. Yeah. Yeah. All right, Sean, I need you and Rebecca to get everything in here packed up and loaded into the truck. Oh, we're you dipping? And I will deal with the Templars. What, they're here? It was only a matter of time before they discovered us. To be honest, I'm surprised it took them as long as it did. Let's go. We're going to leave the Animus here? Okay, this is a crazy way to do credits, so... So, what's the plan? We ditch this place and then what? There's another safe house. It's, we've got company. Uh-oh. The truck's just up ahead. These fools got guns, though, don't they? Do I got a gun? Oh, he's got and a hidden blade. Mind. This is an unexpectedly pleasant turn of events. And here I thought I'd have to waste more men on you. Kind of you to save me the trouble. This what do you guy. want, Vidic? For you to come home. We miss you terribly. There's still so much work for us to do together. It's not happening, Warren. You continue to disappoint in every conceivable way, Miss. <laughs> I saved your life once. Do you remember? And this is how you repay me? You saved me so you could keep experimenting on people, destroying right. their lives. And for what? Oh, this tired argument again. As I recall, you were there. At my side, every step of the way, their blood is on your hands just as much as mine. You need to stop him. I'm on it. All right, I got this. Let's cook him. Bro, I got a hidden blade. I know these fools did not just walk up in here with some batons. Yo, Miles. Miles is crazy, bro. Look, you see this? Look at Lucy. Go, Lucy. We knew she could fight, but Miles, my boy Desmond, let's go. Cooked, bro, you learned for real. Let's get him. Ooh, girl. Chill out. Oh my God, they all attack me at once. I know these fools got guns. They must not want to kill us. Dang. Come on. Oh! Sure have. And assassinate. Uh-oh, Doc. Looks like it's just you and me now. Enjoy your victory, Mr. Miles. Temporary as it is. Desmond, we have to go. That's nuts. There you are. Come on. Help Lucy into the van. Hurry, Desmond. We need to go. I can't believe we fought we'll that man off. Turn, Desmond. Warren's going to get what he deserves. I promise. So what now? Where are we headed? There's a cabin up north. We should be safe there. At least for a little while. I have to analyze those tapes from your session. Figure out what's happening. And then what? Here we go. I've got y'all hooked up. Got a long drive ahead of us. Figured you might want to play around with the Animus on the way. All right, but I got some questions first. I mean, what the hell was that in the vault? What you saw proves everything I was afraid of. The Templars aren't our biggest threat. Not by a long shot. So what? The sun is? What's it gonna do? Cook the earth? Oh. I doubt it. Doomsday? I don't know. There's been some speculation that the earth's magnetic field is weak. Like 2012 a doomsday? A strong flare could flip the poles and cause a geomagnetic That's what it sounds like she's talking about. It's all theoretical, but if it happens, the planet could become geologically unstable. Very unstable. 
It's meant to be the stuff of pseudoscience, but clearly something catastrophic happened to the people of the first civilization. And that woman, what was her name? Minerva, was it? She seemed to think we were due for a second round. So either way, we're fucked. I don't know yet. We'll keep reviewing the tapes. And you can keep digging through your memories. Maybe there's more to discuss. I like how they're playing into right. more conspiracy so theories. Get started. That's nuts. We beat Assassin's Creed 2. Oh, that makes me want to cry. I can't believe it. This game was really fun to play. And thank you guys for enjoying this Let's Play. Those of you who watched from start to finish, you guys are amazing. Um, my goal for this Let's Play was to just kind of enjoy it. You know what I mean? Just take the game as slow as possible and give you guys long episodes. That's what I kind of want to do from now here on out. I just want to give you guys like super long episodes. Kind of go back to that classic let's play feel in a way where it actually feels like you're in a room playing along with me. You know what I mean? Like you're watching a friend play. That's how I like my let's plays. And those are the kind of let's plays I've always wanted to create on this channel. So thank you guys for supporting it. I've seen a lot of people praise this this let's play in particular about that they're like oh my god this feels like i'm playing it along with you or watching you play i really enjoy it it's very comfortable and i'm waiting for each and every episode to come out because i'm so excited and i'm like oh that's so nice it's flattering it really is i'm glad that we got to play this game in particular assassin's creed 2 was freaking awesome from start to finish gameplay was amazing gameplay was probably the best part about the game loved what they did with the story here seeing Ezio's story and then Desmond's story unfold also and we got to see a lot about Altair we're not done with Altair they talked about him a lot in this we got to read his codex pages and find out what happened after the events of Assassin's Creed 1 that was amazing um I'm really liking what they're doing with Desmond's story I'm really intrigued to see how that unfolds also Lucy I'm super interested to see how how much we learn about her because she's so mysterious we still don't know much about her and i'm trying to figure out like what's going on there is she going to betray us eventually i have no idea i guess we'll have to find out but it was really cool seeing minerva and then she mentioned juno and also jupiter like what what the goddess of wisdom I, it only made sense roman deities like duh right so i get it it's cool. This was definitely probably one of the best games I've ever played. I said that I think in the last episode. And on top of that, this is the best Let's Play, literally hands down, that I've ever done on this channel. I had a great time with it. Would definitely play it again um, in the near future. I can't wait to move on to Brotherhood because everyone's saying that Brotherhood is one of the best games, if not the best game in the series. Um, in the last video that I uploaded, there were people in there saying that like, oh, you're going to love Brotherhood. That is going to be your game. So I'm really, really excited. A lot of people were saying Revelations is good too. I haven't heard anything bad about the next like three or four games. Like it seems like collectively everyone likes Assassin's Creed 1, 2, Brotherhood, Revelations 3, and 4. I've seen some people kind of mixed on 3, but for the most part... I've mainly seen positive things about it. But after Assassin's Creed 4, I have seen some of the other games get mixed reviews uh, like Rogue, uh, Syndicate, Unity. I haven't heard good things about some of those games. So we'll see what happens when we get to those games. I know I'm going to like Unity. Whether the game is bad or not, I'm going to like it because I love the, the setting. I love the parkour from what I saw and the assassins looked really cool syndicate syndicate is probably the one where i'm not the hypest about just because i don't know somebody one of my one of my friends did say that i was probably gonna like that one not the most but one of it's gonna be like my top three or four and i was like really we'll see um origins i hear is highly respected so that one sounds cool can't wait to play that one 
Odyssey and Valhalla. I heard Odyssey is really, really good. I heard Valhalla is a mixed bag. Like that one, I've heard more negative than positive. A lot of people don't like that one. But that one ties into Mirage. And Mirage is about to come out in a week. Or like in a few days, actually. Not even a week. Friday. So I, I can't wait to see what happens to Mirage. What people's thoughts of Mirage are going to be. I heard Mirage and Valhalla are connected. So if you want to play Mirage, you probably got to go play Valhalla. <laughs> Unfortunately. I know some people are going to want to skip Valhalla, but... I heard don't skip it. At least watch the story or something. But um, yeah, I'm excited for Mirage, though. Like I said, Mirage is coming out in a few days. And from what I saw, it seems pretty cool. It's going back to the roots for the most part. I mean, it does look kind of modern, which could be a mixed bag. I guess we'll see when when the reviews really do come out and the fans start to get into the game. But it looks like it's a good mixture of RPG and old school Assassin's Creed. But we'll have to see. But yeah, I'm ready for Brotherhood. God, the way that they left off on a cliffhanger like that. So I wonder if Brotherhood starts from where we left off, like literally right after that. No time skip, no nothing. It's just like Ezio leaves the, the chapel or the church and that's where we pick up from. That'd be cool. But it seems like we might be in Rome in the next game. If it does pick up right where this one left off, we'll definitely be in Rome. I need to go watch uh, Assassin's Creed Lineage. I know somebody was like, oh, you should have watched that a long time ago. But I wanted to watch it after this game. I pr I'll probably brush up on the beginning of the game. And then watch it. Okay. With that being said, I'm just waiting to see if there's like an end cutscene scene or something like that before I end this episode. Like I said, thank you guys again for hanging out with me and playing this game. I had a great time with it. Oh, I got some Uplay stuff. Is that it? Oh, it starts me off right back in the villa. Like I said earlier, thank you guys for coming. I'll see you guys next time. Have an amazing day. Don't forget to like, comment down below any thoughts, info, anything that you may have for me and subscribe if you're new. I'll see you guys in the next video. Have an amazing day. Deuces. Hope will never die. Orale.